Hello everyone, this is Joshua Sagona. I'm here to present how our Java terminal is going. Last time I presented a YouTube video, I didn't record my voice, but this time I'm gonna so I can explain things better and faster. So, last time you saw we had a thing where where we can move around with the cursor and type in things. Well now I added in command support, so I can't just type in anything. See, if I type in anything, it says error, cannot find command, blah blah blah. So I have to type the echo, and I can type whatever I want, like hello world, and then hello world will appear. As you can see, I typed in quotes, but the quotes were interpreted literally. So if I, t but if I type in something regularly, it still appears like that because the real echo command does that, so I emulated it. And in addition, um, word wrapping does work, so I can go all the way across the screen and see the results. So as you can see, it word wraps. It does cut it off there. I might change that later to make spaces, whatever. So there's also the ability to add a backslash to literally interpret a character. So I could say, Fred says that, whoops, ah, oh well, Fred, Fred says that beavers should just die. I don't know, random qu quote. But as you can see, the quotation marks are interpreted literally, even though the quotation marks are there. Whoa, you might have just said, because I just made what I just typed reappear. That's right. If I press the up or down key, I can do a uh, command recall now. So that is pretty awesome. In addition, I can also use these kind of marks. So these marks work also, and I can still type this and cast out that. See? It all works! And I think it's pretty amazing. I will show you one more thing. Uh, the page history, the scroll history. As you can see, I have to actually type stuff now. If I use the page up and page down keys, by the way, I made support for home and end. So if I do this, go home or end, I can go back and forth. But, uh, anyways. So now I press page up. I can scroll up and see what has been typed before and I can scroll back down to see what I currently typed. If I type something here, hi, and press enter, it scrolls back down all the way to the bottom automatically. This is a test. I think it's amazing. The emulation is working out very well, and I'm liking how it's coming. So now there's command support. All there is is echo. I haven't made any other commands yet. But we'll g we're getting there. We're getting there. This is pretty fun. Until next time.